and we see that happening still to this day that uh, whenever all uh, people start to rebel uh, and people you know, uh, decolonize or, or what you know there is again a reemergence of this push for but don't do it that way and don't do it with mm -hmm. those people and don't do yeah. it with those ideas and you can do it this way and don't you want to but when you were talking off air before we got started about Clyburn mm -hmm. uh this is what he is doing right now he this it's he is representing this tradition of black spokespeople coming out to uh represent this uh, neo-colonial conservative reactionary response to oppression so black people Yes, the police are doing what they're doing and you don't have any money, you don't have any jobs. And yes, uh, a whole bunch of white people feel very much the same way about their condition. But the problem with the Democratic Party with this last election wasn't that, um, you know, we ran a horrible candidate with horrible politics. It's that we gave too much attention to all of that stuff. That's that's the narrative that Clyburn and the Democratic Party is trying to, to run now, given how close this election was, to say that the Democrats were only so close because they were making the mistake of showing too much allegiance to black people and, and, and cultural issues and identity issues and moving too far to the left with this socialist stuff as if Bernie or anything akin to the Democratic Party was truly socialist or revolutionary radical even. Right, but right. that's the, that's the message. So it's the same thing that that, that began or, or, or took on a new form in the time we're talking about in the Second World War that this this is and it played a part throughout the civil rights movement the black power all of those as as the state would encourage leadership to, that that spoke a certain way about the conditions and then would become incredibly repressive in, in, uh, including to the point of assassination exile political imprisonment to those who would go too far the other way so uh and we're seeing it still happen right now so uh, even as we see people struggle with wearing asada taught me shirts but not actually <laughs> able to organize around the actual politics of the mm -hmm. Shakur. Yeah.